just to start us off, your your thoughts on you know a big um, game ahead, Vancouver and Cascadia Cup. Um, how's the team team handling that? And, yeah. Yeah, I think the preparation so far this week has been great, uh, outstanding. Obviously, it's a big game for our supporters and for us as a team uh, to get off on the on the right foot this week. All right, we'll open up to questions. Any questions in the room? What have these first 48 hours been like as interim head coach? Uh, well, any time you go through something like this, it's very difficult. Um, but we have a great group of guys in the room um, that are helping everybody push through it. What have the conversations with some of the veteran leadership, with Diego Chara, et cetera, have been like? Have you been able to sit down with them individually or more so just as a group? Yeah, it's it's been great. Um, it's been good conversations. I mean, obviously, difficult moment. Um, so, you know, we'll keep those those things. I think they expressed themselves earlier in the week. So, What are your, priority, or your priorities for the remainder of the season as an interim head coach? Uh, I think that one's clear. Try to make the playoffs uh, one game at a time. Um, so we have a difficult challenge ahead of us, so um, we're gonna, we'll start that on Saturday. Having three of the first four home matches, excuse me, three of the next four matches at home, kind of a, an easier launching point, but a little bit more palatable having that home crowd at Providence. Yeah, I mean, to be able to come out on Saturday with your home crowd in, in a game <clears throat> so important uh, is, is going to be, I think, a good feeling for our players to um, try to Get, get everything going towards the playoff push. Um, so, yeah, that's very important. I mean, we have a long road ahead of us, but one game at a time. All right, we'll go to questions online. And Sam, go ahead. Hi, Coach. Thanks for taking the time today. Uh, yeah. We'd love to hear a little bit about kind of the uh, playing system that you're planning on implementing these next few games. Um, are you kind of planning on doing something very similar to the system that you have been playing this season? Any specific changes that you're focusing on uh, moving forward? Yeah, we're going to, you know, uh, obviously we continue to play uh, play the way we've been playing uh, in a 4-3-3. Um, very open about that. I think it's important to keep that structure in place. Um, we have some players coming back into the, into the fold, which will help that. Um, and, and we can grow in uh, more to that 4-3-3 formation. Thanks. And just a quick follow-up on, on that player availability. Um, just love to hear kind of what guys are going to be available that maybe weren't last week and any guys that are that are still out uh, for this weekend. Yeah, we still have one more day of training, so I can't give you a 100% a answer on that. So I'll just I'll leave that till tomorrow. All right, Jeremy, go ahead. Oh, wait. Sorry. Jeremy, go ahead. Hi, Coach. I'm just wondering about Anthony, the new signing from Brazil. Um, how has he been integrating into the team so far? Yeah, he's. Uh, he, we've had him in training the last two days. Uh, you know, obviously when you've you know been out and traveling and and those things, uh, you need to come into the fold slowly. But he's in uh, a great place, and um, you know he's been a great addition to the team. Any other questions online before we wrap it up here? All right. Oh, John Rojas, sorry. John, go ahead. Thank you. Um, Coach, just regarding uh, the staff, so is Carlos staying with you? Is Memo staying with you? Who else is around? Uh, yeah, any any time you go through something like this, uh, obviously Carlos hasn't been at training uh, the last couple of days, but it's he's he's just taking some time to uh, for himself. Uh, obviously, we know his relationship with as everybody's relationship with Geo, and it's important that we respect everybody at this moment. So um, that's really all all I can say about that. He's he's an important part of the staff, and um, he's done a, a a great service with this club, and and it's going to continue on. We hope. Jeremy, go ahead. Did you have another question? All right. Looks like we're good. We'll wrap it there. Thank you, Miles. Okay.